All right, hello. I'd like to test out my program here, Fishing Bot. I have a feeling it is now at a state where it doesn't make mistakes unless another player, um, you know, get, gets in the way of the bobber. Um, in case, in case you aren't familiar with how this game works, uh, in World of Warcraft you throw a bobber out onto water and the water shimmers and at a random point in time, usually halfway to the end of the bobber's uh, cast time, the bobber will splash, and at that moment, you have like a one second window to click on it. And if you do that correctly, you get your fish, as long as your fishing skill in game is high enough. So if you see, if you see my program click on the bobber and it not yield the fish, but it was on time, that's what happened. It's because my, my in game character doesn't have the fishing skill required. Okay, so here I have my program called Fishing Bot, and it will first need to calibrate where the bobber location is in the bottom right hand corner. And to show you what I mean, when you hover over a fishing bobber, in the bottom right hand corner there's a text box that appears that has yellow content in it. Now this is the only indicator that you have actually put your cursor over the bobber. Now it may seem like my mouse actually indicates that, but unfortunately, Java is unable to see that mouse cursor. Um, there's whenever you take a screenshot of your current screen, or you want to get the pixel color at a certain pixel, it will get the pixel color underneath your cursor. So your cursor is essentially invisible to uh, the program, which is quite unfortunate. So we're going to use the content in the bottom right hand corner as illustration for the program. Now we have to calibrate it. I'll sh demonstrate that now. When we click the calibrate button, it'll search for the text in the bottom right hand corner and if it finds it, it moves the mouse, which it just did. So at that pixel, it now remembered the location and it will continue to use that for the rest of the runtime.